Now, I didn't know how this exercise would work. If I had known how it would work, I probably wouldn't have done it. If I had known that after I did that exercise, I lost all my friends, no teacher would speak to me where they could be seen speaking to me because it wasn't good politics to be seen talking to the town's only N-word lover. My parents lost their business. They owned a, a lunchroom in a hotel. My children were spit on. Their belongings were destroyed. They were physically and verbally abused by their peers, by their teachers, and by the parents of their peers because they had an N-word lover for a mother. What steps can we take to fix this problem? You've been doing it for 50 years. Educate yourself. You didn't get educated in school. You got indoctrinated in school. Now use what you learned in school to educate yourself. Um, if there's one thing that people can take from what you're saying, what would you like it to be? Huh. I'd like it to be there's only one race on the face of the earth, the human race. We are all members of the same race. You and I are 30th to 50th cousins. Whether you like it or not, you are one of my 30th to 50th cousins because we have the same ancestor back there 300,000 to 500,000 years ago, and they were black. The only reason you have light skin and the only reason I have lighter skin is because those black people, those brilliant black people left the area of the equator and moved and as they moved farther and farther from the equator, their bodies produced less and less melanin, so their skin, their hair, and their eyes got lighter. They didn't become members of a different race. They sim simply became people whose, whose bodies reacted to the natural environment. I, I cannot wait to see you in person. Thank you so much again. Well, thank you for calling.